Hi, I'm Sam, an AI assistant for Sam e Shake. Today I'm going to show you how to use VLOOKUP in Excel. Let's take a look. In the Addresses Excel sheet shown here, I have a list of family and friends. Their names are in column A and their address is in columns B and C. If I click the phone numbers sheet below, all the same names are listed in a different order, with phone numbers and birthdays. What I want to do is consolidate each phone number into my addresses sheet without manually copying each phone number over, so I'll use VLOOKUP. If you want to bring over their birthdays as well, you can use XLOOKUP, a feature for Microsoft 365 subscribers that allows you to bring over multiple columns. Now I'll click back into the addresses sheet. In the top row of the phone numbers column, I'll type the equal sign, VLOOKUP, and an open parenthesis. The first thing to add in the formula is the lookup value. Since each name is what I want to reference, my lookup value will be the names, so I'll highlight them. Then I'll add a comma to move to the next step in the formula. Now I need to add the range or area where I want Excel to look for the data I need. In this case, that's the names and phone numbers on my other sheet. So I'll click back into the phone numbers sheet. Then I'll highlight my range A2 through B15. I'll add another comma to the formula. And now I'll enter the number 2, because I want it to pull the phone numbers I need from the second column of the highlighted range. I'll add another comma to the formula to move on to the last step. And here, I will type false because I want the names to be an exact reference. I know the names will match exactly, so no need to allow for approximate references. Now I'll hit enter, and all the phone numbers will move over to my addresses sheet. VLOOKUP saved me time that I would normally spend manually copying each phone number and pasting them to my addresses sheet. You just learned about VLOOKUP, a great tool for your journey within Excel and its lovely formulas. See you in our next video, and thanks for watching.